What's up everyone, it's Winstoney coming back to you guys with a brand new video. If you're new to my channel, go ahead and click that subscribe button and click the bell to get notified of every new video I post. I will be doing a giveaway at the end of this video, so keep watching to make sure you guys know how to enter. I've been reading you guys' comments and you guys have been asking me for another how to grow your hair video. And I figured what better time to grow your hair than now when everyone's stuck in a house. I mean, y'all got nothing else better to do. So I've decided to give you guys a method I've been using at least for the past couple months on how I'm growing my hair. I'm kind of okay with the length now. Like I'm not really, my main goal isn't really to grow it. I'm kind of just keeping it curly at this point and just kind of, um, I don't know, I don't really know where I'm going with my hair, but I kind of am satisfied with it now. But I'm still using these oils that I'm gonna show you guys to grow it, and it's actually been giving me really good results. So the first product that I'm gonna show you, I've mentioned in other videos, um, and that's gonna be the Jamaican Black Castor Oil. Now, I usually don't use this brand. Um, this is by Shea Moisture. I usually use the Jamaican and Lime brand of Jamaican Black Castor Oil, but um, I kind of like the little this little thing that they had up here to kind of like squirt it in your hand or finger whatever um so that's why i decided to use this but i mean either way it's jamaican black castor oil the second product that i'm going to show you guys it's the wild growth hair oil now i've been using this for about the past couple of months i can't remember if it was my cousin or my sister who put me onto this um i don't know shout out to shanaya and jada thank whoever it is that uh told me about this but yes yeah, so i've been using this for the past couple of months all right guys this is my hair length before using the wild hair growth oil um the back of my hair comes down to my shoulders pretty much like right here on my bone and then the front of my hair the front of my hair comes to right here so like my chin right here at my chin all right guys so this is a couple months after i've been using the wild hair growth oil we're gonna do a growth check to see um how long my hair has grown since using the oil so last time i did it i took hair from the back so we're gonna take some hair from the back and i think last time it was like right here to my shoulder I said it was on my shoulder right here. Let's see how far it's gotten now. Um, let's see, so a little bit. I guess it was right here last time. Now it's right here. Hmm. Still a little growth. Yeah, it grew a little bit. Now we're gonna test out the front because I did the front last time too. Now last time on the front it was like right here see where it's at now oh well the front has been growing i don't know if it's because i've just been putting more in the front than in the back um but uh yeah there's been a lot of growth on the front this has been a growth check with some great progress now what i've been doing is i've been actually mixing the two and so I've been putting the castor oil in my hair and the growth oil at the same time and just kind of put it in my hair twice a day. Now, before the whole quarantine, I used to just put it in my hair once a day at night. And since I've been in the house, I've been putting it twice. I've been putting it at night and in the morning. And I found that when I put it two times, it actually has been helping my hair even more. So the reason that I've only been putting it in my hair at night was because this castor oil um, I don't really like the smell of it too much. I mean, not enough to walk around during the day smell like it. It might be okay to some people, but I don't really like it. So I used to just put it on at night and then, you know, by the day it just, my hair wouldn't smell like it. Now the reason I think these two combinations work so great is because the wild hair growth oil, it has coconut oil, olive oil, jojoba oil, rice bran oil, and if you guys don't know what rice bran oil is, it is a pretty good oil. It has um, all types of vitamins and the vitamin B, D, and E. It has omega-3, omega-6, and just really good for your hair. It has cocoa butter, pomegranate, um, pumpkin seeds. Yeah, so just like a whole host of oil. And then just mixing the 
castor oil with this kind of just gives it like this extra boost and that extra boost just has really been good for my hair since the whole pandemic happened i started doing it twice now because i'm not going anywhere during the day it's really it's, it's really been helping now the hair growth oil it smells like okay so it has essential oils of sage clary sage eucalyptus frankincense geranium grapefruit lavender and peppermint now I don't know about y'all, but I don't want to go around smelling like all these things at one time. So that's why I said I only put it on at night. I mean, this growth oil, it works pretty good on its own in general. So if you can just get this oil, that's pretty much all you need. But just adding the castor oil in it, it just gives it, like I said, this extra boost that is really beneficial to this. So yeah, the method I usually use when I put this, when I put these two products in my hair at night, um, I'll go through the regular routine. I would shampoo and condition my hair. And then of course I would put it, these two products in. I'll just kind of, usually I'll put the castor oil like around my edges. And then the growth oil, I would just kind of like, it has like this little nozzle there, if you guys can see it. And so I would just like put it on my hair, put it in my hair like this, and then just kind of like rub it in. And then um, just kind of put some of the castor oil also in there, just kind of just rub it in together. And I will put my satin bonnet on at night. That's really important that you guys at least have something to wrap your hair with at night because it's pointless to put it in your hair and then you go to sleep and then your pillow or your pillowcase is just pulling all the oils out of your hair and then it just dries your hair. So it's very important you have something to wrap your hair, whether it be a satin bonnet, a do-rag, a head wrap, um, something to keep the oils in your hair so your hair won't dry out at night. And even having a, sat a satin pillowcase goes a long way and is very helpful just to not dry your hair out. And then um, in the morning, I'll just wake up and then I'll just put it in my hair again. Now that works for me, like it's very important if you guys do it twice a day, make sure you guys pay attention to how it affects your hair because if you put too much oil in your hair, that's just as bad as not putting enough oil because your hair follicles will get clogged up with oil, get clogged up with buildup, and your hair won't grow. Make sure you keep monitoring and um, know when you're putting too much in your hair and when your hair needs oil. You can get these products on Amazon. You can get it uh, at, I think the Wild Hair Growth Oil is about seven, eight dollars on Amazon. The Jamaican Black Castle Oil is about six or seven dollars. So you should spend more than like 15, 16 dollars for these two products. So I will be doing a giveaway. I will be giving away one of each of these to two people. All you have to do to enter the giveaway is just to leave a comment on this video and to like the video and that's it. And I'll be picking two people. I'll meet you halfway to um, getting this. You're gonna have to go to the other half to get both of these products. The giveaway will last a week after this video is posted. Unfortunately, this giveaway is going to be US only because I don't really know what the shipping situation is right now for international shipping. Um, with the whole pandemic going on so it's gonna be US only I will be having future giveaways um, so stay tuned for that <laughs> so I hope you guys are all staying safe during this pandemic um, I do want to thank all of you who have essential jobs or all of your parents who have essential jobs for risking your life every day going out in your community and helping out in whatever special way your job allows you to help out and I hope the rest of you are doing your part in helping to stop the spread of the virus by, of course, practicing social distancing, washing your hands, sanitizing your hands, and of course, wearing a mask and gloves anytime it's essential to go outside. With each of you, we can help to stop the spread of this and really push through it and get back to somewhat of a normal everyday life. I also want to give a shout out to um, we underscore lit underscore 2020. Um, he's an up-and-coming youtuber. He's a part of the Stony family I want you guys to go over there and support him subscribe to his channel and show his videos some love tell him I sent you guys Yeah, so that's it for this video. I will see you guys in my next video